Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and in today's video, I am reviewing the Samsung Galaxy Watch 6. Now, obviously, I had this three with my mobile phone, so if I tap it, the display will light up. There we go, see, it's lit up, but that's the time 6 pm. Now, I'm going to explain why wearing a smartwatch is literally changed my life because i find it so beneficial i find it so useful now i got this watch three my samsung s24 ultra literally now what i'm recording this video with this is what i got the watch three with so that's absolutely fantastic so right i'm going to show you a full review on it like, explain the best features I like in that. And, obviously, it's a game changer for me. It really is. I used to have the Apple Series Watch 3 or 4, I believe, when I used to have an iPhone. And I was never really a fan with a square face on it. But on here, I like the round face. To me, that's how a watch should look, in my opinion. So, right, I'm going to get this off my wrist because it'd be a bit more easier to review than that. So, yep, do stay tuned. Here we go. The watch is off my wrist. Now, obviously, I have the display on in a moment. So, the display will always stay on. To change that, see, you can, like, do that... Display always on. Hang on, it's lost focus. Sorry about that. Display always on. Display always off. But obviously, because I got it off my wrist at the moment, it will automatically stay off. Now, you press the back button here. will take you back to the display. Here is the menu. See, that's my email, my Google Wallet, which obviously... If I double tap at the home button and that, that will take me straight to my wallet. There you go. See my loyalty cards on there and that. Yeah, so fantastic. That's the steps I've done today. 3,630 degree, 30 high, 180 degree calories burnt. Here you got obviously your walking, running, bike. Yeah, that's the steps I've done today. That's if you wear your watch to bed, you know, like the smart watch. Sleep. Body, obviously that's what the temperature is in the moment where I live. Oh, summer bank holiday because Scotland. All oh, right, that's interesting. See, that is the battery percentage on my watch, sixty-five, and on my phone, forty-one. But at the moment, I'm charging it. It's not focusing very well, is it? See, you can reorganise the apps. Like, if you hold your finger down for a couple of seconds, you can reorder the apps, which is absolutely fantastic. But what I love most about this watch is it displays the time, obviously. Now I have it on a very dim display. Before, I was having the display on all together, and I just would tap it on like that to look at the time. Now I have it on a dim display, and so far... I haven't felt it's used up too much battery, so which is ideal to have it on a dim display, because then I don't have to touch it, and then I can see the time straight away. See, it's now gone on a dim display, like, because obviously the watch is... And that is literally enough for me to see the time still, which is absolutely 
fantastic. But yeah, obviously that's our email outlook wallets, messages, fitness, Google Store, Weather. Yes, click on the Weather app. Yep. That's what it's like in my location. 21 degrees. We click on it more. There we go. See? But what I like about it is I can use contacts less on it. I can scan my train tickets when I'm on the train and that. So, yeah, I do see a lot of benefits in this. I really do. And it's really changed my life wearing this smartwatch. Because, obviously, you know, wearing the smartwatch, to me, it stops me from going on my mobile phone all the time. Because when I want to look at stuff, when I want to look at the time, you know, I'm just tempted to go on Facebook and that and then look through absolute rubbish where I feel now I'm wearing a smartwatch every day because I've always been a fan of watches, really. I've always wore a Hugo Boss watch. So, hang on, let, let's go and grab that a second. See, this is my Hugo Boss on. See, unfortunately, it doesn't work in the moment because the battery has run out on it, but I can take it to my local Timpson store and I'll put a new battery in it. Hugo Boss, see, that's a leather strap. Now, obviously, the strap, I feel, has not been irritating my skin so far on this Samsung Galaxy Watch 6. And like I say, I mainly wear it for, like, seeing how many steps I do, wanting to know the time, and using contactless on it because it's less of a ball ache to get my phone out of my pocket and that and obviously scan my train tickets so I can get through like the ticket barrier and that. But yeah, you can have a look. Look at both the straps look very similar size. And I still absolutely love this watch as well, the Hugo Boss one. But this Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 what I had through my Samsung S24 Ultra. I love it. Absolutely fantastic. Just, uh, and I feel the battery life has been really good so far. Well, it is kind of brand new still, so completely understandable. But usually when I put it on my wrist, I wear it on my right hand because I write with my right hand. But they say if you're right with your right hand, you should put your watch on with your left hand. So that's bollocks. You can have it on whatever hand you want, really, in my opinion. But thank you very much for watching. Comment your thoughts down below. I will always reply. And let me know what you think of smartwatches. To me, it's been a game changer. And I definitely like it more than the Apple smartwatch I use to have. Like I say, I'm interested in my steps. It's good I can look at the time without taking my mobile phone out my pocket. And it's good I can use contactless on it as well. So, And obviously it's very efficient because when you make the payment, you don't have to even put your wrist on the terminal. You can put it close to the terminal and it will work. So absolutely fantastic. But both of them are absolutely fantastic watches. I love them. So let me know down below what you think of the smartwatch. As I said, this one, I like wearing this one still. It's absolutely fantastic. And someone, I will get a new battery in it. But you have to look lengthwise. Look, very much the same power. Oh, the watch is upside down in a moment. And obviously, the good thing is it's got a magnetic thing on it. So, which... I charge it up, the watch up, while I'm browsing around on my phone. Obviously, it's locked at the moment because I got it off my wrist and that. So, yeah. But, hang on, I just pause this. There you go, I got it unlocked again. So, you can go on to your satins here. Display... See your brightness settings, always on display. It says it, it 
it reduces the battery. But to me, it's still holding its battery well. And obviously, it's your choice if you want the display on or off. I mean, you could hang it off and then just tap it on when you want to. But I find it's handy if you hang it on the dim setting. Especially when I'm driving, because then I don't have to touch the watch, do I? Because I can always see the time, like, on dim display and that. So, yeah, it's ideal. Samsung Galaxy Watch 6. Let me know down below what you think of the watch, because I really like it. Thank you all so much for watching. Like I said, it's been a game changer. It stops me from being tempted to use my mobile phone all the time. And it's nice to just know the time on my wrist. Bye-bye.